Yeah, you know the vibes, DP215. I'm back with another one. Let you know where I'm coming from. Megan the Stallion is a fucking fraud, man. Please don't fall for those shenanigans, man. Just because somebody cried don't mean they telling the truth. They're a good actor, actress. They try to stand on their lie. Come on now. You know why she really was crying? Because her feelings for him was coming out. That's what the fuck going on. If y'all didn't know. It was the feelings coming out for him. But she flipped the script. Talking about she ain't have an intimate relationship. First of all, he been taking shots at her. Damn it, in every rap that I heard from him. So, if he said he was in his feelings, ain't no nigga gonna keep writing about a chick slickly if it wasn't nothing deeper than something sexual. You know what happened? They just never went public with it. But, she was in her feelings about him because she had a comeback. Did y'all hear the, the comeback? And she was talking about, ain't nobody suck your shit like me. She admitted it right there. So how the hell are you going to make a diss track or a response to all of what he was saying? But in the same token, you go on Gail and say, you ain't have an intimate or sexual relationship with him. Man, that's the dumbest shit I ever heard. Stop it. Stop it. You gotta stop it. Whoever believes her is as dumb as a doorknob. And you just waiting on your turn. That's all it is. You're dumb as a doorknob and you're waiting on your turn. I, I don't I don't get it. Like stop it. And and another thing. If he did shoot you. Right? If he did, hypothetically, because we know he didn't shoot you. How the fuck you start twerking on the video two to three weeks later? How? How? That's a bullet. How? We pay attention. I do. If everybody if else don't. I pay attention. How the fuck you start twerking and it's some hoes in this house. How you start twerking in a video two to three weeks later? Maybe, maybe one. You take a little dumbass picture of your feet. No bullet wound. No bullet wound. And you say he shot you. I'm going to tell you what really happened. This is what really happened. A realist is about to tell y'all what really happened. She invited him to a party, all right? And they rich. They all rich. So everything was there. Every choice of drug was there. Every choice of drug. We talking about coke. We talking about molly. We talking about weed. We talking about pills. We talking about everything. They was off all that, all right? So guess what? Fornicating is going to happen. She got mad that he was fornicating with other women in there because she didn't invite him there for that. She just wanted to party with them, but she didn't want to party with them, if y'all know what I'm saying. It, she didn't want no threesome. He was trying to get that cracking off. So a dispute came about. Once the dispute came about, it got physical. And I'm not going to lie, he could not tame her. Look how she lied. Get all frantic. She was out of control. And he probably figured the only way I can get this girl to relax is if I pull his fucking gun out. And he did. Pulled it out. Cocked it back. Bust that shit. 
But you know who he bust that shit at? At the ground. He busted at the ground. He didn't shoot her in no feet. But you know what? Since he shot it, that's why she's running with this alibi saying, he shot me. He didn't fucking shoot her. He shot it at the ground to scare her, to get her to fuck back, to stop hitting him. Because he didn't want to do no domestic shit, like hit her back. So, with that being said, you know the vibes. Throw the sign up and I shall arrive. Do you understand me? That's why I make these videos because they can't stand me. You feel me? Why would I come on a platform like this and not give you the real me? I'm going to tell my haters, hurry up and die. You're taking too long.